Good morning, grade 11 students. In today's lesson, we are going to have reading comprehension, the prime plan on your student book, page 118. By the end of this lesson, you'll have been able to activate your prior knowledge through responding to two questions in activity A, page 118, Preview a reading passage entitled Prime Plan through Skimming. Demonstrate comprehension through answering three related questions. And finally, use context clues to determine the meanings of seven highlighted words in the text. Activity D, page 119. All right, now let's get started with the discussion questions, page 118 on your students' books. Activity number A. As you can see, we have two questions and we are going to answer the first one. What things must you consider when organizing an event? Which means what are the things that we should think about when we have to organize any event? There are many things that should be taken into consideration when one is organizing an event. Of course, such as the type of the event one is organizing, the goal or purpose of the event, the number of people that are expected to attend, the date, the venue, which means the place where a public event happens, and the catering service, which is the activity of providing food at an event or in organizations. All right, let's move on to the next question. Why would somebody seek a professional to organize a business event? Why would anyone look for experts or experienced staff in organizing business events? Of course, Organizing a business event isn't an easy task, especially if this event is going to be attended by a lot of people. And in this case, when it is a promotional event in which a product is going to be launched or a conference showcasing the importance of the company, it's better to seek a professional to help you organize it. In addition, it will save you a lot of money and energy you could devote to your actual work. All right, now let's move on to the reading passage on the same page, 118, Prime Plan. And we are going to preview the reading text as usual. So previewing will set a purpose for your reading. It's a preparation strategy to improve your ability to focus and remember what you are reading about. So it is very important to spend no more than five minutes. You can focus on the following areas, the text features, such as the words that are in bold, the colored words, stylistically unique words, and the fonts. You can also check the layout, which would help you speculate on why the writers choose this format and the loaded words, what are some words or phrases the writer has used to appeal or to attract the reader? All right, now let's preview the text. As you can see, Prime Plan is the title and you can read also what is written below, the Corporate Event Planner's Business Events Made Easy. So Prime Plan is an event planner. So it can be the name of a business that organizes events. Look here, we have some bolded words. Your job is to tell us what you want. Our job is to do it for you. So here they are addressing the reader and using appealing phrases. Now, how about the dates? We are talking about the business since 1982. You can understand that they are giving background information about the business. 
as you can see here, read testimonials from some of our satisfied customers. So this is a business that has customers. So the text here refers to customers. All right, as you can see, we have Jessica, Susie, Relay, Reginald, who are they? President, director, CEO or chief executive officer and founder. So these are some customers that have managing positions. All right, contact us. So this is the venue and the telephone and the website. This text provides contact details. All right. So after previewing the text, what kind of text is it? Do you think it is a magazine article, a promotional brochure, an instruction manual, or a blog entry? Very good, so the answer is a promotional brochure. All right, now after previewing the text, let's dig deeper in the text. This is the question. Prime Plan is a one-stop shop where you can find it all. What does the sentence mean? This is the sentence. Of course, you can scan the text to understand what is meant by the sentence. You can read in the paragraph or below the statement. You no longer need to call six different companies to handle all the separate aspects. So here is the answer. It means that you no longer need to call six different companies to handle all the separate aspects of your next event because with Prime Plan, you get all those companies in one. Next question. Why does Prime Plan pay full attention to the needs of their clients or customers? Okay, here is the clue. We pay full attention to the needs of our clients because, why? They want to take the stress out of their client's next business function. Next question. Why does Susie Clatchett think that delegating their corporate function to someone else was a wise decision, was the right decision? Let's check what Susie has said. Okay, it's very important to read carefully what she said. So, because Prime Plan handled their event with unsurpassed professionalism, so they didn't have to worry about any of the details. The word unsurpassed means great professionalism. All right, now let's look at the highlighted words or phrases in the text and match them with their meanings. Of course, it is very important to understand the meaning of the highlighted words in the text because they might help us comprehend the key details in this passage. The words are memorable, top-notched, personnel, conduct, put one's mind at ease, testimonial, delegate. The definitions, to give somebody the responsibility to do something, the stuff, a statement showing appreciation for services, unforgettable to organize and carry out an activity, to make somebody start feeling worried or of a very high standard or quality. How well you understand or identify the meaning of these words, of course, of course, we have to use context clues to identify the meaning of these words. Now, let's read the first sentences. Business function should be as memorable as personal events. 
So the word memorable can remind me of the word memory, which is related to the memory. And as I can see here, there is a word also related to the memory, which is unforgettable, something we cannot forget. So the answer is D. Fortunately, it means luckily, which is something positive. Delivering a top-notch corporate event is just a phone call away. So this is a word that describes the corporate event. And we can know the meaning of top, something that means the best. So what's the meaning of top-notch? Very good, is of a very high standard or quality. All right, we have now the word personnel, conducting, put your mind at ease. We have to read the sentence from the very beginning. Our personnel can offer you a large number of suggestions. So who do you think offer suggestions? Of course, it should be a person. So the word personnel means the staff. Very good. Conducting. In fact, Prime Plan can make organizing your next function a breeze by doing everything. From carefully designing your invitation and publicizing the event right through to conducting evaluation of the event. To conduct evaluation, so this company is going to evaluate. What's the meaning of conducting? Is to organize and carry out to do something. So this is to conduct. Put your mind at ease. So what are you waiting for? Invite us to organize your next company function and put your mind at ease. This is an appealing phrase, which means F to make somebody stop feeling worried. How about the next one? Read testimonials from some of our satisfied customers. So these are quoted from some customers. So this is what we call testimonials. Testimonials here, according to this context, means a statement showing appreciation for services. Because if you read that, thank you, thank you, right from the start, so they are showing appreciation. Next one, delegate. At first I was wary of delegating our corporate function. Where we here means not completely trusting. All right, to delegate our function to someone else. So to delegate my task to someone else, to give my task to someone else. So this is A, to give somebody the responsibility to do something. All right, now let's check your understanding and make sure that you comprehend the brochure that we've read through the questions that I'm going to display. It's okay, you can pause the video and try to answer, then check your answers. The first question, what is the purpose of the brochure? What is the aim of the brochure? It's to advertise or publicize the main business line of Prime Plan. So what is the main business line? Is to organize events and conduct evaluation of the events. Next question. Why does the brochure contain testimonials? to show how much Prime Plan's customers are satisfied with the service and that they really put their minds at ease. And the last question, is it paid? Of course it is, because first of all, it's a business that aims at advertising the business itself. And there is a piece of evidence in the text, discounts are available for new customers, which means that it is paid. All right, I recommend that you think about this question and you discuss it with your teacher. To what extent do you think brochures are effective 
to promote a product or an event, especially with the rise of digital marketing and advertising. You can share your answers on the Microsoft Teams. This is all for today. Thank you so much for watching the video. Have a nice day.